Hello viewers, Chief here. Welcome to my new subscribers and welcome to anybody that's just clicking through. Today we're going to be taste testing the 3D energy drink and today's flavour is cotton candy. We've got 16 fluid ounces of 473 mils on this can. We're going to include a screenshot of all the stats on there so you can have a look at your own in your own time. Uh, I thought this seam here was from a plastic sleeve which is shrink wrapped to the can but it's not. It's probably just the way that the paint or the label goes on there but it's not a sleeve it's actually part of the aluminium so there we go let's open this one up and see what flavor we can pick up but it does say it's cotton candy let's do the old psh test see how much pressure's in the can and there was a reasonable amount of pressure but there's a lot of spits all over my hand all over the top of the can I don't think I've opened it very violently or shook it around too much let's see what we can pick up with an aroma I can't smell anything at all. Very, something very sweet, candy flavoured, maybe like a little raspberry hard lolly that you suck. But let's see when we pour it into the can what it comes out like. Very, very light pink coloured. There's a lot of bubbles in there. Look at the froth on that. The bubbles are dissipating very quickly. There's a lot of small and medium sized bubbles in this glass affixing themselves to the outside. They're the ones that are dissipating very quickly. The liquid is very, very clear. There's very slight tint, pink tinge to it. And as you can see, that ice cube's floating probably three quarters of the way under the surface, so about 70, 75% of the way through. There's a few spits on the top of the glass here. Let's have a smell and see what we can pick up. Yes, it's very faint hint of cotton candy or fairy floss that you get at the carnival or the circus or the fair. So I'm looking forward to this one. Let's have a little taste and see how we go with that. It's exactly what it tastes like. Although, the sweetness comes in in the middle once it hits the tongue and the palate. And the bitterness is at the start. The aftertaste is quite sweet. So you get that bitter hit first, and then you get the sweetness in the second two phases, which is a bit odd. But it just tastes like cotton candy. But not a very strong taste of cotton candy. You couldn't mistake it for anything else, but it's very, very subtle. Very refreshing. I don't think you could have this as a hydration drink. I think this is a drink you'd have just as a special treat to yourself. It's got a pretty coloured can, which is sort of very light metallic pink, and I suppose that's roughly the colour of cotton candy. Very interesting marketing technique. What you see, what the flavour is, and what the colour of the can is, is the same colour as the liquid virtually. So you can see they're pretty close in colour. So all in all, it's a very clever little trick. It's not a bad drink. I'd give this one 7 out of 10. I would purchase this around my top tier of drinks if I felt like a little treat and wanted something that was a little on the sweet side but not overpowering. Very consistent flavour. As I said, the bitter kicks at the start instead of at the end, which is a bit of an odd thing, but that's just the way it goes. It's not bad at all. I thank you for watching. We'll see you on the next test.